You got cousins, you got aunties, nieces, nephews. You trying to help everybody but your family? You got a baby mama who don't like you and you don't like your baby mama, but you trying to fix the community. Let's get real black man. And one thing a man do, he don't stop and listen to no other man that's talking, running his mouth that he can't see in real life and watch his actions. A man don't do that, fam. We get this from Mama and them. Mama and them took us to church with them, and we sat next to Mama and them while they listened to the preacher man. So you know what we did? We developed a desire to have a man preach to us like Mama and them. No, no man sat down and listened to Farrakhan. No real man is listening to Elijah Mohammed, nigga. Because can't no man tell another man how to conduct his household. That's what little boys do because we went with mama to that church house. So we grow up looking for a man to teach and preach to us. So we've been following our mamas. I hate that you niggas think I'm y'all leader. And I ain't leading a motherfucking thing, nigga, but my children. I don't nah. give a damn what happened to y'all. I don't give a fuck who kids die. Long as they ain't dying. Oh, no, nah, for sure. The first rule of life is self-preservation. It ain't, homie. When a man looking in the mirror, minding his business, and don't give a damn about nobody else but him and his. That's what a real man do. He don't give a damn if his neighbor beat his wife. A, a real man don't give a damn if his next door neighbor starving. I got to take care of this family. What go on in this household? You don't worry about next door. You don't worry about across the street because when I die, they ain't gonna worry about you. When we crying over here, when our lights go off, they ain't worried about us. Fuck you worried about outside this house for. I was raised that way and I raised my kids to be that way. No, almost definitely. So now, nah, nah, homie, one thing a man do, he don't submit to no calling and no teaching of another man. He go Go to the bar and drink, nigga, and talk to the bartender. He don't run to the preacher house and let no man teach and preach to him. He go sit with other men and they talk about their problems at the barber shop. But no man stands above another man and say, I'm the leader, I'm the preacher, I'm the minister, and I'm in. No, that's the submission of a woman. I swear to God. I swear to God. No other man sits before another man and sits down and let him teach him how to be another man. That's what the boy do. That's what the woman do. So now, homie, you don't submit your ears and you don't give your heart to the teaching and the preachings of no man. Nigga, go in the closet and close the door in darkness, nigga, and get on your knees. Lay face down on the ground. Lay flat on your back, nigga, and talk to yourself and watch self answer self. And watch self answer self. Everything that you need in life, everything that you need to build, everything that you need to grow, everything that you need to die with lies inside of you, homie. Nothing is external. But the motivation to dig deeper inside. But everything is inside. It was already placed when you was born. You have to know how to go within and tap within, nigga, and tap into the gifts. The, your God exists within you. He that is in me, he that is in me, it don't exist outside of you, young brother. I swear it don't. Don't let them trick you. And listen, I'm just on here bullshitting. Half the shit I'm saying, I don't mean. Half the shit I talk about, I don't care about. I just found a way to be entertaining, and it pays very, very, very well. Oh, no, nah, for sure. I'm about to get on that same wave so I get my little stuff in order. Already, black man. Let me know when you're ready. All right, Mr. Charleston. Peace. Yeah, I'm going to get to you real. I ain't going to shoot. I love that little nigga spirit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And, and we done fucked around before. Yeah, yeah, I love that little nigga spirit. Yeah, yeah. Look, see, can't, can't nobody teach and preach like this here to the mass. Hey. Yeah, we just on her having fun, nigga. Hottest nigga on the internet. Yeah, yeah, I don't like Chicago niggas. Yeah, yeah, I hate Chicago niggas, my nigga. I don't want nothing to do with Chicago people. Y'all please stay away from me. Yeah, 
Chicago is bad luck. I don't want nothing to do with Chicago people, nothing at all. I don't want to be on their platforms. I don't want to talk to them. Them people got some of the most horrible luck in the world. They're not blessed. They're not prosperous. Their kids don't do well. They don't get along with their baby mamas. They don't try to make up with their old friends. I'm living good, and I'm setting out shows. You guys are still on YouTube talking. Man, I don't want to do none of that shit. I don't want to do none of that shit. I don't want nothing to do with Chicago. I would never do another interview with a Chicago person. I would not do one with DJ U. I would not do nothing else with the Chicago people. I've grown past Chicago, okay? I'm dealing with Lil' Tim. I'm doing a Lil' Tim documentary. I don't want nothing else to do with nobody from Chicago. I don't want to make Chicago friends. I don't want to do nothing in Chicago. I don't know about Chicago, we didn't grow up, we learned about Crips and Bloods, we don't know nothing about GD and BD, I don't want nothing to do, I don't give a damn about Chicago people, fuck them Chicago people, I don't, I don't want their support, I don't want nothing from Chicago, I think Chicago is cursed, I think everybody going to hell in Chicago, I think all children are retarded, I think the babies is going to suffer with, 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 with get cysts on their eyelids because their mama's got HPV, Human papillonian virus in their pussies. Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. Now, nah, I don't want nothing to do with Chicago. I don't want nothing to do with Chicago or California. I won't do no shows in Chicago. I won't do no interviews in Chicago. I won't have nothing to do with California neither, except Oakland. Oakland, California is the only place I visit. Other than that, it's gang banging town. I don't want nothing to do with no gang banging towns, period, point blank. I put my right hand on the Bible. I swear for God as my Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ, I would never do nothing with nobody from Chicago, ever. That's my right hand to God, my nigga. That's my right, right hand to God. Uh, I don't think. I don't think people from Chicago have anything that's worth listening to, watching, that could bring the betterment of black people. I don't think that there are any smart intellectual minds that I can sit down with uh, out of Chicago. I will never let nobody from California or Chicago, no platforms, never, ever, ever, as long as I'm alive. I swear to God. So, no. So, you can hang it up, buddy. Next, with nothing to do with you people not knowingly and intentionally i watched all y'all do this nobody does this from chicago nobody goes up your platform does this and just go beep. i do this beep, 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 beep. see i be see i got lights in me so no no chicago no chicago to my friend Beep, beep. Beep, beep. Council. Yeah, yeah, nah, homie. Y'all ain't, ain't nothing good coming to y'all. Y'all curse. So y'all kind of like the Dallas niggas. Dallas blog. You thought I was... uh, hold on one second. I'll be right back. Right. Hey, what's going on, man? What's up, brother? Not much, man. Just want to get on here and show these young dudes who's on here listening to you. I knew you was at they can do, somewhere. They can do shit like this. They can work on, oh, on airplanes, I, go from the block and work on airplanes. Yeah, yeah. You working on planes. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. You a different kind of nigga. Oh, yeah. The streets don't make us. They just Are made us. A different kind of nigga. Nigga, you working on planes and things. Oh, yeah. No oh, doubt. Salute fuck, to you. Fuck, Everything fuck. you be saying, appreciate the game you be dropping they on fuck, it. For real. Must be a military nigga. No nah, man, the streets just made me that way. Nigga, I fuck, <laughs> who, who taught you how to turn them notes and them nuts and bolts and shit? This shit right here. That nigga, an airplane mechanic. Oh yeah, the only black man in here working, man. Y'all niggas can do the same thing. All they got to do is apply themselves. Yeah, that's it. That take too much reading for these niggas. You ain't, you ain't never lied, man. But let me get back to it. <laughs> Soldier, I appreciate I, you, man. All right, big dog. Yeah, yeah, he's uh, a different kind of nigga. That nigga working on planes and things. That nigga, that's a different kind of nigga, man. Shit. That nigga skilled with his hand. 
He don't know that he can do more. Niggas see most these niggas ain't skilled with their hands, huh? They just be talking. Niggas don't know how to do nothing. That motherfucker's son coming through that motherfucker. Yeah, most niggas don't know how to do nothing, my nigga. I swear. Shit, I see a nigga doing that kind of shit, man. You salute them niggas. That nigga working on what? Planes? Nigga, where you learn that from? That nigga said from the streets. Hey, what's your address, bro? I'm on the way. Drop your head. I'm on the way. <laughs> I'm on the way. Hold on, I'm gonna block you from the other phone. On the way. Yeah, I hate a bitch ass nigga that'll watch me all day long acting like his mama. Think I'm supposed to be scared and he a giggle bunny. <laughs> <laughs> that nigga giggle buddy. <laughs> this is what I be saying. Nigga. Uh, uh, let me see. What's his name? Trips 45. Trips 45. Nigga black it. Oh man, trip twenty five. Like yeah, look at this little sissy. Hey, look at this little sissy. He thank you. Thank you. This nigga gay in the mother. Boy, you a die coming over here. <laughs> Feeling like it. Yeah. I try sandwich. Do we just bag a daily? It hold more than a hundred fifty. I ain't losing nigga, I'm winning. Y'all rock shit in the average. Yeah, that man, little boy better get his little ass off somewhere. You suck dick like your mama. Nigga <laughs> with them pretty ass hair dudes. <laughs> you little boy kill me. <laughs> man, what's up, huh? Uh, nothing for the block you. What you gonna block me for? Uh, nothing. Cause I don't like little boy like you. you know, nobody a little boy, you dirty ass nigga. You, smell you like sound booty like one. Nigga. You're calling me unk. Why would you, you smell like shit, nigga? Unk. Fuck you, nigga. You smell what like you, uh, shit, nigga. Man, you smell like hurt. shit, nigga. Man, you smell like shit, nigga. Fuck you, nigga. <laughs> you <laughs> old, nigga. Fuck you, nigga. <laughs> Your mom should have swallowed you, nigga. Well, she didn't. Nigga, your daddy should have left you on the sheets, nigga. Fuck you, nigga. He didn't. <laughs> <laughs> Is there anything else you gotta say before you are sentenced to death on this chapter? <sighs> yeah, man. Block him, man. That, when they block it, take you away immediately. <laughs> and next. <laughs> ah! <laughs> Let me see. Nigga, you taking too long to answer. You finna get blocked. I am Raya. Okay, you taking too long. I am. You finna get blocked. Raya. R-A. Underscore. Another private account. Block. Yeah. <laughs> View request. That's good. Peace of love, Charles, and peace of love. Okay. Yeah.
So I'm just getting off of work. I just want to go ahead and just, I see everybody calling in, showing love. So I just want to show some love my damn self. You had me laughing all day while I was at work. So I did. That shit be funny in a motherfucker, don't it, dog? Hey, man, listen, I was there. It was hilarious. You was called it all out, talking about niggas is going to come up here with hard hats on, or they going to have their ceilings showing, and that's all that popped up after you said that. That shit had me weak. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I mean, but I really be, I really be hurt these niggas' feelings. They really be wanting to cry. Yeah, you had me rolling today, man. I was going to pop on, but I was like, nah, my ass at work, too, setting up. I ain't yeah, yeah, yeah. I was going to say all kind of Because in my mind, homie, everybody know if them people catch you at work on them phones, it's going to be some problems. Especially yeah, exactly. if you're in the safety, in the world where, nigga, they big on safety, like construction. So I'm saying, homie, why would a nigga jeopardize his job, jeopardize the coworker saying, He's not a good worker because he always on his phone. Why would a nigga do that, homie? Because the image and the perception he give off, the other workers see you doing this. And you can best believe they telling the boss because you black. Everybody yeah, gonna hate on you. You right. You right. So, My job laid back his damn self and 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 shoot, since people see that I'm using my phone because I got headphones in, now they want to do it. So come on. Yeah, homie. you're right about that. So what 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 happens is the nigga be known for the bullshit nigga at work, always on his phone. Taking longer, longer breaks, ain't never on time, always complaining. So the nigga don't never be the good worker. This shit gets my job go by faster. Like sitting back and listening. Like, but, you but know what listen, listen, listen to what you said. You listening. Yeah. You ain't looking and listening and holding the phone. Yeah. Because right. if you got, got the phone in your hand going live, guess what? Nigga, you ain't doing you nothing ain't with working. your hand. You ain't working. Yeah. So the white. Are you while you laughing and bullshit with me with the other co-worker the other co-worker just looking up while you holding the phone say hey look i got charleston nigga they they taking notes especially if you work with other ethnicities so i'm saying why not go be a standout nigga at work nigga fuck that phone why are you so into a nigga online that you will jeopardize your job i don't get that my nigga you right you was calling a lot of stuff out you know what I'm saying? That's what made it more funny. Because, I mean, a lot of stuff that you were saying was happening as you was, you know, staying on the live regardless. You were like, man, it's going to be more niggas coming up here that ain't got shit going on. And it was that one dude that you had up there, man, that had me crying. You was like, he was like, I just dropped my girl off at school. And shoot, I'm about to, you know, clean up. He was like, well, why you didn't? Why ain't you starting right now? Well, here, let me help you out. <laughs> and I got the phone. That shit had me crying. Yeah, homie, you done drop your girl off at work, and nigga, first thing you do is go home and get online and talk to a nigga as soon as you get back home. First, first yeah. thing you do, nigga, when you drop your girl off at work is to go get on live with a nigga. Man, these yeah, you niggas party, crazy, man. my nigga. Well, shit, I just coming up to, you know, show some support because I seen everybody else coming up here showing love. I hope you feel better. That shit about the white folks getting you sick. And, and, and where they came from, you ain't lying. You know what I'm saying? I I got elders that tell me, you know, when I was younger that, you know, you know, white folks ain't, you know, they ain't they ain't human and shit like that. They come from this and that. And I was like, man, what he said, I used to hear that back in, uh, you know, when I was growing up in the night. It's the reason, reason why they're called Caucasians. Car I don't even, I don't like to try to call them white. I try to call them what their race is. Caucasians. Carca and they come from the Caucasoid Mountains. Yep. Cold. They come out of caves. Yep. They could, I learned could never stand know. up and look at the light. They, ah! Ah! Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah. The light have always bothered them. <laughs> hey, man, I'm going to get off of this before. <laughs> I'm going to get off of this before some people that follow me see me. <laughs> All right, I will let you go, black man. I got, I got people that follow me that, you know, that's Caucasian that fuck with too, me. Like, but she, you know, nigga, the truth hey. is the truth. Yeah, I do too, nigga, but the truth is the truth. Nigga, my mama told me the truth don't care about nobody's feelings and neither the God. He care more about your salvation. Yeah, yeah, the truth don't care about nobody's feelings. You, I'm going to let you rap me. Nigga, send me the info on how to get me rap. I'll bring my shit tomorrow and get that bitch rizz out.